What's up guys? It's Sophia. Welcome to So Freaking Good. Today we're learning how to properly cook quinoa so that it comes out perfect every time. I'm going to show you how to make it and it's so freaking good. Quinoa is actually not a grain, but a seed, which makes it gluten free and perfect for people with food intolerances. If you haven't already, hit the subscribe button and don't forget to press the little bell so that you get notifications whenever we post a new video. So we are going to add one to two tablespoons of butter to a pan and let that melt. And to the melted butter, we are going to add one cup of quinoa and we're going to toast for a few minutes or until it starts to smell fragrant and maybe gets a little bit darker in color. But one to two minutes of toasting and stir frequently. To the one cup of quinoa, we're gonna add one and a half cups of water or broth. Cover this with a lid bring it to a boil, and then lower it down to a simmer for 10 minutes. This quinoa turns out perfect every single time. All it takes is a little bit of effort and 10 minutes, and you've got perfect nutty quinoa that's an excellent side dish to any meal. Give it a try and let me know in the comments what's your favorite thing to have with quinoa. If you like this recipe, why not share it with a friend? We'll see you next time on So Freaking Good. Quinoa is actually a super seed. No, not a super seed. It's a seed. Or a seed. Today, we're making quinoa. Perfectly cooked, nutty. Nope. Nutty. Why is nutty the first thing that comes to mind? I mean, it is, but still. Okay. Fun fact, quinoa is packed with fiber and excellent for maintain. No. For what? Excellent for what? I don't even know where I was going with this one.